guys, it's RVD here. Hope you guys are having an awesome, awesome day, an awesome week. I'm back with another deck profile video, and this time, I got Blounds. We are doing Blacephalon today uh, as our deck. Um, uh, this is my deck list I'm running with Blacephalon. This is a basic list. Uh, I did switch a couple things out of it. Uh, I took a couple things out, and I put a Marsh Shadow and two field blowers in. I don't remember what I took out specifically, but yeah, that's all I really changed. I think it was an Andrew Mahone list, but I'm not sure. But anyways, this is a deck list I'm going to be playing. Also, I have lots of information to tell you guys. So, uh, I'm thinking about, well, the first thing is, and I'll tell you more during the video while I'm playing, but, um, the first thing is, is that uh, I finally reached my Twitch affiliate in less than two days. Um, on Twitch, and I thank everybody's support for that. I, I very much thank you, all of you. Now, also, I am now provided or affiliated with ProfessorOak.com, and they're a code seller promotion. So they sell like online codes for packs, and uh, I'm provided by them, and I do giveaways for them on Twitch uh, almost every stream. So uh, make sure to tune in to my live streams. I stream from a 5.30 a.m. Central to 12 o'clock p.m. Uh, Central. So from uh, 5.30 in the morning to 12 in the afternoon. Central Standard Time. Uh, so I hope everybody goes and uh, supports my um, Twitch channel and also supports this channel as well. I hope everybody's had a good day. Also, I'm thinking of changing my deck up for Dallas. Uh, I was going to run Espeon, but I've been playing around with some other stuff and I kind of like um, Buzz Rock better um, so uh, I'm still thinking it's either going to be Espeon or Buzz Rock I just don't know which one yet for sure it may even be I may even try to build a Zoropod list if I have enough time in eight days so also and this is another little reminder um, probably the next this next week um, we'll probably, uh, we'll probably be a little slow. Also, tomorrow, my stream is going to be shorter. Uh, tomorrow, January the 11th, well, my stream will be a little shorter because I have things I have to do tomorrow. But otherwise, uh, I, I will still be streaming. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, I'll be streaming from 5.30 to probably like 9 tomorrow. Instead of 12. Just because I have things I got to do tomorrow. And, uh, then on... What else was I gonna say? I keep blank blanking myself, man. Anyways, let's get into this. Let's get into some matches here. Uh, yeah, like I said, thank you all uh, for all the support that has been happening this whole week. Uh, everybody has helped in, in any sort of way. And we're gonna save this deck list here and let's go try this out. Let's go see how this works. Let's go to reverses. I'll play about three matches probably. So I'm what I do for every deck profile. Which, you know, my, my Buzz Rock list is a little different than the one I posted on here. Uh, I took out the extra rumor raid, and I took out a Guzma, and I put in two blowers. That's all I changed on it. But we're going to do regular Blacephalon today, not Blacephalon Kiawe. We'll probably save that for another video in the future. Which, yeah, uh, I finally got Blacephalons, which is happy, or which I'm happy about. I finally got... Um, I got my Twitch affiliate, and then, yeah, all sorts of awesome stuff just happens. Shuffle me, daddy. That's a funny name. That's hilarious. Okay, so let's see. He's probably playing. Sh oh, he might be playing Blaze himself. Let's see here. So we start with the Blacephalon, and I've been playing around a lot with this deck, so like I I'm kind of used to it now. But the first day of playing it, I was kind of actually confused of how to do it. I mean, I've watched so many people play it, but then once when you play it yourself, you're like, so, what's a misplay and what's not? You know what I mean? So, it's kind of like that. Uh, we're going to Mysterious Treasure here. I placed the Beast Energy onto the Blacephalon. We're going to grab a Poi Pole. And, there's that. Choice Band, that guy. We're going to Mysterious Treasure. That's kind of tough there. Um, we'll take the Poi Pole, though, for now. We got a Stretcher in here, so we can just... Stretch it back later. We're gonna Cynthia. Alright, and then we got... We got stuff for next turn, so... 
we're just gonna pause it there and pass it to my opponent they're playing a Moltres so this might be some sort of shrine deck a lot of people have been playing that shrine what is it it's like the Typhlosion shrine I got a couple of matches with that online a couple these past couple days which I also I finally completed my versus ladder if you didn't notice uh, up there and I finally beat that so uh, I got the full art Hiawe and uh, clean my ladder but yeah otherwise I've been doing pretty well I hope all of you guys have been doing well this, uh, this week and I hope you guys all had an awesome relief of Christmas and New Year's Eve parties and all sorts of crazy stuff um, I'm going to start trying to upload more um, like maybe start doing it two or three times a week depending on it it depends how money comes in really um, and if I you know how donations work and stuff if I get more decks to build and more decks to play and stuff then for sure like I already almost I need one Oranguru and two Diantha and I can uh yeah hold on so Ultra Ball sorry um yeah, and then I can play at Grand Bowl, which would be a fun video to play. I know lots of people like watching that. So we're going to go here. We're going to do this. And then I'm just going to... Mind blown. One, two. And hit done. So he'll do 130, and we'll take the knockout. And that's perfect. Sorry if you guys hear a wild doggo in the background. That's my dog, Ted. He's a yellow lab. He's a cute, big old, hairy guy. Love him so much. So what this guy does here. So... Make sure to go check into my streams and make sure to check uh, also in my streams. I got actual stream currency set up, um, and I got it set through. I got it set up through uh, Steam Labs chatbot instead of Nightbot. And I've also been doing lots of giveaways there, courtesy of Professor Oak. Um, what else? I tried to do giveaways on YouTube. Uh, I was going to try to announce a giveaway on YouTube, but it just didn't work. Um, like I the, all, all the websites and stuff you kind of have to like pay for and I don't have money to pay for them otherwise I would do giveaways on here but if you want free packs and free codes make sure to go check out my twitch like I said I'm live every day uh, and and also go join my discord because that's when I update when I go live and sometimes you know, I may be a little later or a little earlier depending on just how I feel you know and how the days are going and what's happening yeah, so make sure to go check all of that out. I'll leave it all in the description below. So I'm, I'm happy I got my Bocephalons because I've been wanting to play this deck forever. And I'm probably, right after Dallas, I'm probably going to build this in real life. And probably just play this because it's easy, it's simple, it's fun. Um, and I've had a great time with just playing it. Oh, and he just gives me the victory. Okay, well let's hop to another match here. We got our coins there. But, yep. I've just been doing well. Um, I got all my stuff done. I got an in-game streamer currency. We also have, like, uh, heists and stuff like that. And battle duels and stuff. So, that, that that's really fun. And, uh, I'm ready to see how that works. And see how that flies around in the chat. I hit 70 followers on uh, on Twitch and in, in about like three or four days which is pretty insane at least to me it is um, this is kind of a really busted hand even more busted um what do I want to do here I think I'll go with the ultra space because then I can just go like I can just go like turn two. I can grab another poi pole. Yeah, so my, my turn two, I'll grab a poi pole. I'll ultra ball for a poi pole. Or for a, or 
grab another Neganadel. Uh, Ultra Ball for Neganadel. As long as I have two of them. And then I'll even throw Heat Factory up there. We are playing against Metal, so we do have a uh, an actual advantage here. So we don't have to like waste too much of our energies on this uh, on these guys. And that's even more better because I'm gonna do this. We're gonna Ultra Ball real quick. I'm gonna grab Neganadel. And now I'm going to Ultra Space for another Naganadel. We're going to charge up twice here. And this is, uh, I honestly thought this deck was going to be a little strange when I first saw it and first saw people play it. But now that I'm playing it, I, I've loved it ever since I started playing it. I don't want to play it in Expanded, because I know in Expanded it's not that great. I'm going to go ahead and throw a Heat Factory up there. Just so that way I don't draw back into it. So I'm really just trying to draw into like another point pool and some more other some other stuff. Then we'll Uh, a little Acro. We'll grab the Band. And then Acro Bike again. We'll keep the B-string in deck, because B-strings are always, always good. Uh, I guess we can go ahead and place this other Blacephalon down. We'll mind blown for one, two. 200 damage, we'll take the knockout. Yeah, that's just how fast this stuff sets up, it's crazy. That's what I'm saying, I, I love this deck, it's absolutely wonderful. He's gonna fry and pan me. That's fine. We got Magnezone out. There's no energies in their hand, so. Because it's attached from hand, right? Yeah, okay. There, I mean, they have no energies in their discard, so that's. Let's hope he don't pull three energies so he don't wreck me. Okay. He places down the Mount Coronet. Sometimes I do get a little worried about the about playing against uh, dust main just because it, I know it's dangerous to play against and I'm really I'm more worried about like the B string turn than anything but I think we have it under control for right now for sure we do there goes the frying pan there goes the Mount Coronet uh, <laughs> they give us a little mad face there Understandable. Uh, we will Cynthia here. So like I said, I hope all of you guys are having an awesome day. Um, and I hope you guys are having a good time watching my streams and hanging out. And uh, I'm gonna place this Beast Energy. I guess I could do it there, and then we're gonna Ultra Ball these. Hello, hello guys, I'm back. I'm sorry, I had to uh, take a pause real quick because, uh, so let's see what's going on here. Uh, my, my grandmother, uh, my grandma had something to tell me, so I'm sorry about that, guys. Um, but I'm back now. Let's see. I know we're in, like, really good control here. I'm just gonna start putting stuff in my hands so that way I don't draw into it. And we'll just mind blown. Take the knockout. Hopefully they don't have like triple B string or something in their hand. Because that would be terrifying.
How much does that do? Huh. What? Oh my god, what does it do though? I can't see. Uh, you can use it every way you want. That's ridiculous. So we got that. We'll charge up twice. And I think we'll just like. Should we Marshadow? Or should we. Probably Lele for Cynthia. Probably the better choice. Oh, I don't have any more Cynthia, so I guess I will just Marshadow. Forget it. Hopefully, I have enough energy left. Fuck. We got Sightseer. It's Acro by. Grab the B string. Play the B string. Sightseer. I'm gonna keep the stretcher in my hand. And we get the dub. Nice. No, I think I'm gonna play one more match for you guys here. Hopefully we get a full match here. Um I said sorry for the interruption. My grandma just had to tell me that the dog was outside. So uh yeah. Um and sorry for the dogs barking in the background if you hear them. Let's get into another match here, hopefully with no interruptions. So that way I can just get it done. So make sure to go check out my streams. Make sure to keep liking, subscribing on here as well. Because I did go up on here in subscriber count as well. And I'm uh, thankful for that. Uh, I thank all of you for helping me out on here and watching my videos so uh hope you guys enjoy that or enjoying the content and for all the new people i hope you like it and yeah and i will be vlogging dallas and i'll be introducing you to most people that are that go to my league and uh they're all cool people and yeah i hope you guys enjoy that too also we'll uh probably uh, if I can get some streamers in my video, I can, I'll try to do that, like maybe like Sombra or Ben, and shout them out as well, of course, because they're all awesome. I'm going to get rid of the Sightseer in this. Energy, I'm going to grab me a Poi Pole here. I'm going to Lily for a lot, and really get nothing out of it that I don't need. Which sucks. That could have been a way better Lily, but we'll take it. I think we're playing against Shrine. Oh no, it's not Shrine. Huh. I have a headache now. Nice, so he'll be doing like 50 damage to me. It's wonderful. Huh. Boy, energy. We'll ultra ball some of these away just to get some more stuff out. Oops, Cynthia. I really need like ultra space. That helps.
we're grabbing the Ganadel. So one of our boy poles is prized. I guess we'll just mind blown. I have a feeling even though we knocked this out, we're going to get toasted next turn, so. Here's B string. Guard field. And they get double heads. Which is unfortunate for us, but it's all right, I guess. If you're gonna trade, probably trying to find a DCE or something. Trading away a timer ball and a psychic energy. You got a pal pad. There to pass. Oh, this is ridiculous. I guess we'll just charge up pass. And this is kind of the bad thing about sometimes what we'll Cephalon. It kind of just dead draws. And they're playing Garb. That's helpful. Very good to know. I get an energy. What I might just do is just charge up, place the energy, and attack with the the Ganadel on the on the garb. That's wonderful. That's even better. It's supposed to be like a Zoro control deck or something. So I guess that's a knockout, isn't it? That's fine. This guy's about to get toasted. So we're gonna double charge up, double B string. Busted deck. See, double charge up, double B string. Do I want to play the Guzma? I don't think so. I think I want to just take a knockout on this guy. So we'll go double B string. One here. I want to get. Probably should get like a healthy Naganadel down. Mind blown here. One, two. One, two, three, four, five. We take a knockout. If probably has another DCE in hand. Oh, I should have. Oh, wait, I, no, I pulled out a prize so. I didn't actually misplay there, surprisingly. Oh, that's unfortunate. Is it a Cynthia? Hmm. He needs to garb out. Is it in here? 20, 40, 60, 120. So not enough for a knockout, but pretty close.
Alright, no DCE, which is wonderful. I'm actually just gonna go here, do this, grab Lele. We're gonna field blow over that. And then we're gonna Lele for Cynthia. Huh. So we'll place the new down. I'm gonna B string to one of these guys. And then I'm gonna I think I'm gonna burn them and confuse them this turn. So he has to play like a Guzma or something to take a knockout. Kind of what you're starting at Guzma. So I can just Guzma retreat and take out one of the garbs, but then we're just trying to figure out and see how we're gonna win here. We have eleven cards left, we have fifteen, so we're ahead right now, for sure. If they place a DCE on here and try to actually attack. How many DCEs do they have in discard? They have two. So maybe their other two DCEs are prized. That'd be very unfortunate. That'd be kind of funny. You're going to Guzma. He's the E-knockout. Damn. Yeah, I don't know if we can win this now. Well, I guess we still can. I need choice band, though. Or really, even if that, I still can't. I'm gonna charge up. We're gonna marsh out of. Hmm. So we go ultra space, beast energy. I'm gonna look through my deck. Huh. Okay. I'm just gonna bursting burn here. So at least he has to play a Guzma to knock me out. Damn. Yeah, I think that's game for us, man. There's no way we can win now. Yeah, there's no way we can win. Oh, man. Well, I think that's going to be all for this video. I'm sorry if it was kind of eh. Um, here, I'll give you, I'll give you guys the list so that way you can see it. Um.
this is the basic list for it uh, that I used here in this video. I hope you guys all enjoy. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Uh, so, like I said, sorry for any interruptions and stuff. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I really am. Uh, it's just life is life, I guess. But that match, we we're kind of just in the hole already. Uh, playing against Zork, it's kind of hard. And then having to hit, you know, five energies and a knockout is ridiculous. But yeah, so I hope you guys enjoy. Uh, make sure you keep hitting the like, subscribe, and uh, make sure you go follow all my links and uh, uh, and come check out a live stream. If you don't uh, have make a Twitch account, come follow me. Come check out a live stream and see how it is. Uh, we do giveaways. Uh, we have in-game currency or in-stream currency now, so you can start earning yourself some currency. Maybe reward yourself with some packs in the pack in a store, maybe. So. Uh, if I get that set up, so uh, yeah, come by, come through, come hang out, come have fun. Uh, love you all. See you later. Goodbye.